and if you have your master's degree with you then the ctc offer will be different so both of the ctcs are different for the btech and mtech guys ti uske upar char chand laga rahi hai to by offering you a huge package of 35 lakhs approximately now after offering you the joining bonus and retention bonus company offers you another bonus and this is a component of your ctc and it is called as relocation bonus so with all of these components you have completed your 27 lakhs from your ctc now the rest of your uh, amount is your rsus hey everyone welcome back to the channel it's long time i am not connected with you my videos are not so regular since few days but despite this i was posting regular content on youtube and linkedin and it was all about the vlsi new updates and news so if you have followed me on linkedin and youtube you must have enhanced your knowledge about the vlsi and i have posted a most uh, important content uh, regarding vlsi so you must have gained a good knowledge about the vlsi since few few months so first of all let me thank all of you for making my subscribers count to 5000 and it has just crossed 5000 count successfully so it's an achievement for me and you guys as well so i'm, I'm very much grateful to all of you now i am looking forward to cross next milestone and that is 10000 subscribers i hope uh, we would uh, cross that count as well so as you know in my past videos we have covered the ctc breakup of intel and qualcomm and we have seen like what are the increments uh, they generally give to their employees boys and we have covered their joining bonuses their retention bonuses and we have even covered the stocks they offer to their employees so all of the content we have seen like what are what is the exact ctc breakup of intel and qualcomm both of these videos gone pretty well because you have liked these videos really much so if you haven't seen these videos you can check out the description box i have pasted the links over there so both of these these videos are really really good for you so as you know the current market situation of vlsi semiconductor industries is improving and it is reviving with a better growth and with the better financials of the companies as you know intel qualcomm are gaining their market back with respect to pc market with respect to processors uh, at the same pace nvidia is also getting their customers and apple has recently placed an order for gpus to the nvidia also apple has placed an order to tsmc for their uh, 5 nanometer and 3 nanometer meter chips in the near future so as you have seen like every domain of semiconductor is just improving as the demand is increasing the companies are gaining their b2b business really really good and b2c business is also really uh, doing really good especially for the vlsi so that's why the market is gaining back and there are huge plenty of job opportunities in the market i have seen like my, uh, many many companies like intel qualcomm and media all are hiring they are regularly posting job opportunities on the linkedin and on their website as well their portals are open for the job opportunities you can apply there as well so with these new openings everyone is just so curious about the ctc they offer a uh, ctc offered by intel qualcomm nvidia and amd so if you are a fresher or even if you are switching uh, to a company in vlsi sector so this video is going to be helpful for all of you guys because i have covered the ctc breakup of the new company as i have promised in my recent community post on youtube and linkedin as well so this is the company which is texas instruments so i have covered the recent ctc they are offering to the freshers and to the candidates who are just switching to the texas instruments from a startup or tie to company so in this video i have covered the ctc breakup of texas instruments for their digital or analog profiles and we are also going to see the joining bonus the retention bonus the stocks they offer to their uh, newly recruited freshers and uh, to the newly recruited candidates you can say so all of these uh, things we are going to cover so before starting this video let me uh, again tell you that if you haven't subscribed my channel then you must subscribe this channel and i am posting this video within few days because i have to edit this video as well so after posting this video you must have to comment on my video because Uh, if you comment if you like this video i came to know like students are uh, liking my videos so this is the kind of motivation i want to have because i have to post my content then i must need a motivation and you guys are my motivation so please subscribe this my channel and you must comment on my videos and you must like this video so let me start with the introduction of texas instrument texas instruments is an american company founded in 1951 that designs and manufactures semiconductor and various ics 
The Texas Instruments focus is on developing analog chips and embedded processors, which account for more than 80% of its revenue. That is, its 80% of total sales are from analog domain. TI is one of the top 10 semiconductor companies all over the world. So that's why I have decided to cover the CTC breakup of TI. It has their three offices all across India and those locations are Bangalore, Pune and New Delhi. But uh, the technical teams generally sit in Bangalore and Pune only. So if you are recruited to TI uh, in technical domain, then you must have to relocate to these uh, Bangalore and Pune locations only if you are not residing in the Southwest India. So without wasting any time, let me disclose the CTC of the TI which they gonna offer to the freshers. The CTC offered to you is totally dependable on your qualification. So if you're joining TI after your BTEC, then the CTC is different. And if you have your master's degree with you, then the CTC offered will be different so both of the CTCs are different for the BTEC and MTech guys now let me tell you TA offers a huge CTC of 34 lakh 64,285 rupees for the freshers who are going to join after BTEC it means you have just college finished kiya hai or you are already in your party mode or TA is charging you by offering you a huge package of 35 lakhs approximately and it's gonna really big big amount for you guys basic in hand salary is se thodi kam hoti hai jo ki main aapko bataunga but itna bada package apne rishtedar ko batane ka to alag hi maza aata hai so this 35 lakh is for the btech graduates and if you have your masters degree with you then ti is going to offer you 36 lakh 39285 rupees as your ctc so that's why i generally say doing mtech is always a better option after btech because by doing mtech you're not only getting a better ctc uh, from the btech guys but you're also going to see a better curriculum for the vlsi sector so having good knowledge having good skills is really really important in these days so while doing mtech you know about the publications research papers so even you can uh, publish good research papers by adding your guide into your uh, as, as your guidance even you get prone to various opportunities to join the international and national uh, conferences so all of these things came into your uh, life when you are doing your mtech so i feel doing mtech is always a better option if you are uh, looking for better opportunities as a job in your uh, life now coming back to the ctc as i have told like 35 lakh is the ctc for the uh, btech guys and 36.5 lakh something is for the uh, mtech guys so having 35 lakh ctc never means that you are going to have in hand salary that is 35 lakh divided by 12 and this is gonna be your monthly in hand salary which is approximately 3 lakhs so this would never be the case but yes there is a huge possibility that in near future you are gonna get this much amount in your in hand and that would be approximately 3 lakhs because VLSA is a growing sector and is it is just outperforming uh, out of the way and it is just having better packages so that's why getting 3 lakh per month in hand salary is just possible for the VLSA guys but uh, Getting 35 lakh CTC never means that your in hand salary would be 35 lakh divided by 12 and that would be per month. So that's never possible. So let's look over the breakup of this CTC. TI offers this CTC for both digital and analog profiles, but generally TI recruits for the analog profile and those are like PRL engineers and uh, test engineers, etc. Now the very first component of this CTC is fixed component. So this fixed component is 16.75 lakhs for the BTEC guys and 18.5 lakh for MTEC guys. So this is the first component of the, your CTC. Now when you divide this fixed component with 12, this is your monthly in hand salary. So now you can say that your fixed component is your base salary and this is what you are getting in hand. Now the second component of the CTC offered by TI is the benefits. So every year TI offers you some benefits and some reimbursements and those are like your evening meals and your snacks from the TI and your gym memberships, your Wi-Fi, etc. So all of the bills you can get reimbursed from the TI company directly and this is worth rupees 1 lakh. So rupees 1 lakh is the benefits component you are getting in the form of CTC and this component you can uh, consume like you can have your reimbursements, you can purchase bicycles etc. Now this is not just enough, there are other components as well which are going to be added in your monthly in hand salary and one of those bonuses is your annual bonus. So this is the component which is going to add in your uh, monthly salary but it is completely variable. This component totally depends upon the market situation of the VLSI zone. You have already seen like there was huge market dip in the profits and financials of the VLSI companies and that's why this component was really much uh, lesser 
because uh, the situation was not really good so this component is totally variable and this annual compensation got decreased when the market situation is not that good but now since the market situation has revived the companies are gaining back their profits their revenues and they are on the pace to uh, getting more and more uh, orders for the customers and for the uh, companies as well there are various service based companies like cadence and opsys and all other companies which provide their EDA tools. So these are comp these are the companies which are also reviving because they are getting bigger orders from the US and from the India Indian market. So that's why I'm just saying that this uh, current market situation is, has just improved. Since the markets has improved, so TI is offering an annual compensation of 3.35 lakhs annually. So isn't it huge? You are getting this much amount in your CTC package. So with this, we have covered three components of your CTC, but we haven't touched one component that is very, very important, which is tax. So at each and every component, tax is going to be deducted and it is going to be added in, into the accounts of government of India. So if we are talking about the tax on your annual compensation, it is going to be directly 30%. So 30% of the annual compensation amount is going to be the accounts of uh, government of India as a tax and left of the amount is yours. Similarly, tax is also going to be deducted on your base salary and that is totally according to your slabs, according to the new design and old design. So apart from these components, there are other components as well. So let's discuss about those components. So when you just join the company, बहुत ही ज़्यादा खुशी होती है because new environment, आप कॉलेज जो उनसे बाहर निकलते हैं, so it's a really happy moment for you to join a new company. So आप जब कंपनी को ज्वाइन करते हैं, एक तो पहले ही इतनी खुशी होती है, जैसे-जैसे नया प्यार होता है, सब कुछ अच्छा-अच्छा ही लगता है. So in the same way, आपको बहुत ही मजा आता है कंपनी को ज्वाइन करके. और अब अगर कंपनी को ज्वाइन करने के बाद अगर नए नए बैंक में नोट आ जाए तो उसका भी अलग ही एक सेम तरह का जोन बन जाता है तो यस आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द ज्वाइनिंग बोनस तो इमीडिएटली जब आप टीआई uh, में ज्वाइन करेंगे देन यू आर गोइंग टू हैव अ ज्वाइनिंग बोनस फ्रॉम द कंपनी एंड यू गेट अ ह्यूज अमाउंट ऑफ थ्री लैक्स इन योर बैंक अकाउंट एज ज्वाइनिंग बोनस कॉलेज में तीन हजार रुपए रखने वालों के अकाउंट में तीन लाख रुपए आ जाए तो आप समझ सकते हैं कि कैसी खुशी होगी बट इस खुशी में गवर्नमेंट आपको थोड़ा धोखा दे जाती है बिकॉज यू गेट to pay a tax on this amount as well. So directly 30% tax is going to be deducted from this joining bonus. So you will be just 2.1 lakh in your hand. 90,000 is going to be in the accounts of government of India. But 2.1 lakh is also a good amount as a joining bonus. So now if you complete your one year com uh, successfully in the company TI, then you also get your other component from the CTC and this is called as retention bonus. So this retention bonus is amounts to rupees 2 lakhs. So this is a kind of motivation company pays you in the form of uh, notes and this is like companies uh, willing to have you at least of one year in the in their firm. So that's why company gives you an a, a retention bonus of two lakhs rupees and which is also completely taxable. Now after offering you the joining bonus and retention bonus company offers you another bonus and this is a component of your CTC and it is called as relocation bonus. So if you are going to move from one place to another to join the company as a fresher, so company provides you to be your expenses like your traveling expenses, your air ticket, one two months rent. No doubt, जो आपको relocation bonus मिला है, वो बहुत ही जल्दी खत्म हो जाएगा because if you are looking for a good flat in Bangalore to stay, then twenty then seventy five thousand is nothing. So with all of these components, you have completed your twenty seven lakhs from your CTC. Now the rest of your uh, amount is your RSUs. So this is another component which company offers and this is called as restricted stock units. So any listed company which is listed on any stock exchange like NASDAQ for US and BSC, NSC for India. So any of these companies can offer you uh, stocks worth their amount which they are willing. So TI offer you stocks of worth $10,000 in your bank account and in your DMAT account. So if, if you convert these dollars into Indian rupees, then these are 8,30,000 worth stocks you are getting into your DMAT account. Now the number of shares is totally depending upon the current market price of the share. So as you know, the technology market like US tech market is totally technology driven. So having the shares of these tech companies is really good for your portfolio. TA does not give you the worth $10,000 stocks in just one time. The vesting time of these uh, stocks is four years. So just like Intel, Qualcomm, 
uh, all of these companies generally uh, pays you the stocks or gives you the stocks in your demet account or your uh, stock account in the span of four years so it's a kind of strategy you can say or a tactic to keep you in the company and these companies uh, use this kind of phenomena to have you in the company for a lifelong tenure so with this we have completed all the components of the ctc and it is worth 35 lakh for the btech guys and approximately 37 lakh rupees for the mtech guys so if you have liked this videos then do share this video with your friends and your other tech guys so they can at least get to know about the ctc of the ti company company for analog and digital profiles thank you so much for watching this video i am really grateful to have you guys and do subscribe my channel and comment on this video as well thank you so much thank you